Okay, should be second stream should be going now. Jesse come in today? Haven't seen him. Alright, those of you on YouTube, we'll start in just a little bit. miss a Jesse comment early on. I thought I did and I just remembered it. Hard to catch them all when you're focusing on the cards. Let's hit some of the bigger names. Let's do case two. This is the jumbo. There's Jesse. How you doing, buddy? You know, I missed you in the first half, Jesse. Sorry about that. Thanks for the uh, the starting lineup, man. I appreciate it. Case two. Good luck, everybody. We had a lot of parallels in case one, but we did not hit many big names. Had a couple nice cards in there. Hit a really nice card for the field spot. And a really nice orange insert auto. Kind of whiffed on the bigger five or six names, though. Let's see if we can hit them in this break. You get a lot more autos in the jumbo. 24, at least. And let's see what we can do. Same rules apply. This is just the second half of the break. Aaron Judge insert. Adonis Medina blue paper, numbered to 150. A gold buyback of Robinson Cano from 2006 Bowman. It's fairly early in Robinson's career.
Not yet, Jesse. I offered it to him for a hundred. He didn't say no, but he didn't say yes. It's only been about a day, so maybe he just missed it. He wanted it, so I'd be surprised if he doesn't take it, but Did you list it higher than a hundred bucks? Just one fifteen. I might just change it to a hundred in general pretty soon. Auto number one. The base auto, one of the top names, called for it, and we started in. Kevin Maiton for the Atlanta Braves. It's a nice clear picture there of the auto. It's pretty clean. He doesn't seem to streak very often. Nice base auto there. That's a good start. Toronto Blue Jays and another auto just like that. Back to back packs of auto, another nice one. Jason Groom. I do slightly like the autofocus better on Chrome just because I like to show the. It bothers me, you don't show the auto close. I think for regular stuff, cardboard stuff, it's a lot better the other way. Talent Pipeline Oakland A's, J.P. Crawford, Brian Anderson Refractor to $4.99. Well, you talked about not getting anything tough a grill, and you got a refractor auto. That might be as tough as it gets for him. That's crazy. Yeah, he'd have to have at least a super. That'd be crazy not to have a super. Brendan Rodgers insert, Nolan Arenado insert. I don't understand it, really. Yeah, that's strange. Maybe. I can't, I can't ever think of a time where they didn't do color autos. They're going to put the color of them in Bowman Chrome or something? I mean, if they, the guys, they short turn it on the colors. I mean, like, you look at years past, last year, and kind of, you can have refractor. I mean, usually they just cut out the refractors and the purples. That right. Do it. That means there's something else going on. Either the colors and different product or something. Ian Happ insert. Yeah. Uh, Jesse Hollins set, uh, buyback. It could be do doing something similar to what they did with Brian in 13, but. That's a strange way of doing it, but it could happen. Yoan Mankata insert and Ivan Rodriguez. Uh, Eric has a Sterling Trout Auto. Oh, really? Yeah. Is it graded? Yeah, it's 9510. Dominic Smith insert and oh, nice insert auto there. Man, I love it that they're on card for these guys. Greg Maddox. 19 to 25. That is awesome. Man, so much better than the stickers of past for the Bowman insert autos. Man, first box for me was phenomenal. Maddox, Groom, and Maiton. Let's say you start a jumbo case. The Maddox is number 19 of 25. It is OC top to bottom, but if you've seen this product a lot, they all are. They're all like that. I don't know if they'd factor that in grading or not. I'm sure they probably would, but it's almost like Topps changed the design slightly because they're all, they're all like that. I don't know, but that is a sweet card. Yeah. I really like the 92 Bowman design. Yeah. That would have. When, when Groom is your worst auto, that's a good box of cards. Not done yet. Maybe we'll get something else tough. 
There's a red in here, a 70th red of a popular player. Yankees Pipeline, 70th red is of Guerrill Jr. Getting a couple nice cards of him for the break. How you doing, Jacob? We got a Musgrove paper parallel, number to four ninety-nine. Josh Hader, blue shimmer. And CJ Wilson buyback. Uh, there's probably, I'm sure there's a Maddox spot. If yeah, there's, somebody yeah, there. there's a Maddox spot. There's basically a spot for um, everybody that has an auto in it, um, except for the possible lucky redemption spot. Kobe Allard insert and Giancarlo Stanton. Tyler Glass now, Mike Piazza insert. One box done. Box two. Arizona Diamondbacks insert, Sandy Koufax, Frank Lombretto Refractor, number to 499. Got a gold auto coming up. Behind Jose De Leon is a pure gold auto. The regular gold of Justin Mace. I think Eric hit him too, didn't he? Justin Macy. Macy? From the Blue Jays. Justin's getting too much glare to focus, I guess. There he is. Nice looking gold auto. You just missed him, Scott. Number 20 of 50. My friend that opened some jumbos the other day hit something of him too. I can't remember. Was it a gold or a different one of him? I don't remember. Can't remember. He hit something of him. Too many cases to try and keep them straight. Yeah. Four pretty nice autos so far. I think he goes okay. I know he's not a top name, but AJ Puck insert and a buyback of Robin Ventura, Chicago White Sox, 1997 Bowman. And here it claims destroys my pitching every time. Jeez, that guy! I have to hunt for some of his cards, don't I? Because as soon as I hunt and leave it out, they cool down. And Purple, Andy uh, Ibanez. Purple, number to 250. Rizzuto and Syndergaard inserts back to back. He 
We have 2011 Bowman base. I hope this amazing case. The Hoppy was not a terrible case, but it lacked the top names. Those guys pay a lot for this spot. I'd like to hit some of them up. Hunter Renfro insert, Dodgers pipeline, and Reds 70th, Juan Hillman. Did you? I'm sorry, I didn't hear what you said. 2011, where he had his cards? Okay. I didn't open a ton of that year, but I opened some. Tyler O'Neill. We opened some for sure because uh, we hit the Blue Harper yep. back in the day. Base Auto. Alerni Garcia. For the Philadelphia Phillies. Seems like the Phillies have a lot of autos in this product. We actually, in years past, have done opposite. We've done really good on the hobby. Yeah, we've had a few year streak where we've just really killed the hobby. Last year was awesome. We've hit some really tough orange autos. Um, Jake, this box, we hit Maddox, um, Justin Mays. Macy. Macy. Macy and Garcia. The Macy was a gold. You're welcome. Looks like we're done with this box for autos. Garcia insert, Garcia to $4.99, and Greg Gagne for buyback. Philip, I hit a buyback the other day for you. I think Eric Hitt or something, whoever it was, I talked him into giving it to you. It was a Dan Gladden. Because I know you like Dan Gladden. There's no way you don't. Pipeline, Seattle Mariners, and a blue auto. Wow, look at that. This, this is a bonus auto, isn't it? Oh, wait, was the Maddox the other case? Okay, Maddox was the other one. Who cares? That's gorgeous. Sorry, I was off one auto. That's the third auto. Very nice. Andrew Benintendi, number 25 of 125. This jumbo case has some signs of a crazy good case. Can you get me some more 59 or so? Are there right here? I got this one right here. This one's 59. Should probably buy some more 59. That is the very first Andrew Benintendi Bowman autograph we've hit this year. Right? Mm -hmm. I'm not forgetting about one. It's a pretty well-centered, clean autograph looking card there. Congrats to the owner. Let's keep it going. Let's keep hitting big cards. I think of you on all these twin buyback cards, Philip, because I know out there you're going to like them more than anybody. Matt Manning insert, Daryl Strawberry. Well, we got our first chrome red of the year. We have no autos left. We still, this is our, well, our first regular prospect. Right? We haven't hit one of these yet, have we? We haven't hit a red refractor. Right. We hit one. Insert red auto, but that was it. We hit one now. That's a pretty good name. Brent Honeywell. Oh, he's killing it. Two he's tough parallels. Two now. tough parallels in this case for Brent Honeywell. He is at the top. Of the ace prospect list for pitching. 
He's got a career minor league ERA of 2.58, career whip of 1.01, .01, more strikeouts than innings pitched for a career. It's a fun box to open. Tom Gordon buyback. Kind of wish I would have had an auto left when I hit that, but have a little bit more suspense. Freddie Freeman was to four ninety nine. You got your food? That's good. Need fuel. Yoan Mankata insert and Jorge Mateo insert card. I think this box is finally done. One last pack. It's been all kinds of parallels. Cal Quantrill insert and Chris Bryant. I got some paper in there by accident. Got excited when I saw the red. Two boxes. We got six left. Give me one second. I got something here I have to check. Do you know if he actually posted the bonds? Uh, yes. Any activity on it, you know? Second here, sorry. You have to check on one thing. I think it's gone anyways. All right. That solves that problem. Box three. Oh, Red Acuna Auto. Man, that's a big card. Sorry about that, man. I've been there. three Aaron Judge insert and the first base auto first auto with this box is a base auto Angel Perdomo for the Blue Jays Getting lots of Blue Jays cards Lots of Blue Jays. Yeah, it wasn't mine, fortunately. I would die for that card. <laughs> Somebody said he saw one in a break. He just he just missed the Braves, and then they hit a Red Acuna. Oh my God! Pipeline Marlins and seventieth of Tamayuki. Sugano, Sugano, Man, would, Alex Brigman. That would make me sick. I wouldn't watch the rest of the break, I can tell you that. <laughs> I would take it off. Oh, really? You know, this year stuff, that's very common. I will say that to everybody. It's very common to hit two parallels of the same person in a case this year. If somebody does half cases, don't be shy away from the second half if they hit a certain guy in the first half. Lux insert and Mike Gallego. Mike Gallego. Gallego. I remember him for Oakland. 
You know, we had that happen numerous times in cases where you hit multiple the same guy. We hit four of one guy in a case. We hit four Kyle Funk houses in the same other case. <laughs> four of <laughs> Luckily, we had a big Rutherford in there to save us. <laughs> I shipped that today, too. We paid for it. Hank Aaron insert, Orlando Garcia. I would say that Rutherford is probably the one that's the best for us so far in our yeah. cases through and through. Uh, Guriel in, uh, insert, Texas Pipeline. Hey, there's a nice card. Just had to mention the guy. We did. We never get him. Ronald Acuna Refractor. We're hitting the guys that we never hit. Yeah, I agree. That's the second Acuna. There's been another Acuna in this case? No, no, I mean oh. the second one we've hit all time. Yeah. And the second Guriel Acuna. That is number 245 of 499. We've hit some Alfaros. He uh, doesn't sign the card very good. Uh, yeah, we've hit one or two Alfaro rookies. Maybe more than that. We've hit more than that. Yeah, we've more than that. Yeah, he's right. We've hit probably more like about four of him. Yeah, but we've seen about 14 cases. Dansby Swanson insert. Glaber Torres, red or blue parallel for the Yankees. Nice card there, number 64 of 150 for Glaber. And John Patterson insert. Is Alfaro going to get called up pretty quick, or is he up in the majors? Yeah, the top prospect for Texas a long time. We got Angels Pipeline, and the final autograph of box three is Abraham Gutierrez for the Atlanta Braves. Abraham is box number, or auto number nine in the case. Two Braves in box three, Acuna Refractor and Gutierrez Base. And we hit Maitan in box one. A lot of the Braves player spots are hitting now. Got a gold in here. It's a gold insert, so it'll be a nice card for somebody. Behind Ozzy Albi's insert is a gold of Alex Bregman. That's the second Alex Bregman parallel in this break. This is a 92 Bowman Gold. It is number 33 of 50. We hit an orange of him in the first case. Orange insert, not an auto. Nice looking card of Brigman. Chipper Jones right behind it. Insert card. Killing it in triple A. Got a gold paper of Jackie Bradley Jr. for the Boston Red Sox and a blue refractor of Willie Adams, number to 150. Got an Ian Desmond buyback. Greg Maddox insert, Carson Fulmer insert. Last pack of box three. 
Eloy Jimenez, insert, and Mike Trout. Box four. Yeah, Jake, it's just kind of that way when... I think it's the timing, honestly, of him being a first curl model right when he gets called up. I really think timing's a huge part of it. Now, if he keeps playing well, timing isn't going to matter. He's going to stay hot. I always sold his cards well, though, before this. But they blow up. I mean... Aaron Judge is just crazy blowing up, too. I've always sold Aaron Judge pretty well, but right now he's going for huge prices. Box number four. I have always sold Christian Arroyo well, though, before this. Not like what he goes for now, but... Got a couple nice gold parallels of him, you know, that went for 25 30 bucks, Way better than most people. Eric Fetty insert and Chris Gomez buyback. I have a blue auto of him to list I got from somebody. Mets Pipeline, Josh Hader Refractor, and Kershaw. Alex Bergman insert in a refractor of Jose Tavares for the Philadelphia Phillies. Yeah, the home runs are what makes the news, though. The average will matter, though, more over time. Two months from now, if he's batting 190, that will bring down his cards a little bit. He's a pretty good contact adder, adder though. He's more of an average hitter than a home run hitter. At least in the minors. Who are you talking about? Christian Arroyo. I think you'll bat like 260, 270. And then maybe go up from there. That would be solid for him his first year, though. Wilmer Becerra. Base auto. When Joe Panic was first called up, his cards were flying too. I saw you gone to a few Dodger games this year, Steve. How many have you been to? Mike Trout insert, Xander Bogarts. Four. Those look like fun. You watch them hit three home runs off my closer. <laughs> yeah, Not David David Dahl insert and pipelines. Were you there the other night when they came back and won? Soto purple to two fifty. That was off JB's closer. He wasn't happy about it. That's like my world with closers. He got a little glimpse of it. Houston Astros pipeline and a rookie auto of David Dahl for the Colorado Rockies. It is the rookie auto. Dahl has got a nice signature. I kept showing it on MLB tonight. I'm like, ah, oh, I get it. <laughs> I saw it. Thanks. <laughs> Don't need to reload that. 
Bellinger was what the second one. Yeah, you hit his right off the uh, screen on the pole. Yeah. He's gonna get called down or uh, sent down again. It sounds like. Who's who's whose spot did he take temporarily? Uh, they had several people on the disabled list. That... Josh Bell insert. Acuna is the parallel to 499. Chase Utley buyback. I hope not. I want Naris to uh, keep that job. Braxton Garrett and Dansby Swanson. I got three packs left. Kevin Newman insert and Ted Williams. Hi, David. Um, haven't seen anything of him so far, Tavares. We have not hit much of him so far in this product. I saw his carts were going really well. There might be like a Scouts Top 100. There over. might have been an insert. I'm not sure. No autographs of him, though. We've had a couple insert autos. Teoscar Hernandez, purple to 250. Juan Hillman, 70th blue. The first one is actually on YouTube if you want to watch the recap, too. Jan Gomes for anybody out there. And we're almost halfway done with the second case. First case is on YouTube. Cotton and Chris Bryan insert there. That's four boxes. Oh, yeah. You want to open the last four? Sure. All right. Jason's going to open the last four. I gave him a nice target for this case. Some good autos. The autos so far in this case, we got a dull base, Becerra base, Gutierrez base, Perdomo, Garcia, Groom, Maton, a refractors of Tavares and Acuna, a beautiful blue auto there of Andrew Benintendi. It was numbered 25 of 125. Macy Gold and a nice Greg Maddox insert in his Cubbies uniform. So good luck. I hope the second half is as good as that. There's some nice cards in there. All right, jumbo box number five. That was a nice Ben and card. Pack of box five. We got Bowman Scouts, Forrest Whitley, Yunel Escobar, bronze stamp buyback, What's up, Jesse? How are you, bud? We got a gold here. We got a gold autograph. We got Talent Pipelines, Cardinals, Jack Flaherty, Harrison Bader, and Brivik Valera. Maybe it's not autograph. That little white area fooled me. 
A little white section there. Cole Stewart, gold refractor. 13 of 50. Apologies for the gold auto bluff. Chris Bryant, 51 insert. We got Rookie of the Year favorites of Tyler Glass now and a Refractor Auto. That'll do. Glaber Torres, Refractor Auto. Very nice. Number 153 of 499. Nice first auto for me. Labor Torres Refractor 153 of Breaking my heart with those Hector Neres comments. 48 insert, J.P. Crawford. 92 Bowman, Dansby Swanson. We are an extremely deep fantasy baseball league. Auction format, 16 teams. I had Neris for three bucks. I was hoping he was solid the entire year for me. We got Scouts insert of Carson Fulmer and a base auto of David Thompson. Base Auto, David Thompson. Is he just throwing it too often? What's up, Tyler? How are you, bud? David Thompson, second auto in box five. No Senzel. No Senzel yet. Did you win? Did you win, Senzel? We got Rookie of the Year, Aaron Judge. Talent Pipeline, uh, Kansas City Royals, Chase Vallett, Ryan O'Hearn, and Jorge Bonifacio. And we got a 70th anniversary red paper of Brett Honeywell. Brett Honeywell has had several tough parallel cards in this break. We actually sold... Uh, not too long ago, a black label, black label base auto of Mikel Franco on eBay for a pretty good chunk of cash. One of the three black labels we've ever got.
Talent Pipeline Insert, Cubs, Eloy Jimenez, Ian Happ, and Mark Zagunis. And a Purple Auto, Luis Carpio. New York Mets prospect number 223 of 250. Third auto of box number five. Carpio Purple, 223 of 250. Rookie of the Year favorites, Carson Fulmer. We got Silver Paper of Tetsuo Yamada to $4.99. And a Bronze Stamp Buyback of Andrew McCutcheon. Bowman Scouts insert of Alex Kirilov, 92 Bowman, Mike Piazza. Rookie of the Year favorites of Yuli Gurriel, 92 Bowman, Bowman of Ivan Rodriguez. Got a blue paper of Paul Goldschmidt, 133 of 150, and a purple refractor of Tetsuo Yamada, 33 of 250. Also have uh, Ugi Urbina, Bowman Buyback, Silver Stamp. Never thought I would say Uga Thurbina in a player break. Last pack of box five. What's he in prison for? That's right, that's him, isn't it? Tyler Beatty, Bowman Scouts. 51 Bowman, Corey Seeger. I was in South America somewhere, wasn't it? Where that happened? Crazy.
Venezuela. Box number six. Jumbo box number six. We got Orlando Arcia, Rookie of the Year favorites. And a base rookie auto of Joe Musgrove. First auto of box six, base rookie auto, Joe Musgrove. We got Talent Pipeline Brewers, Lewis Brinson, Brett Phillips, and Corey Ray. And it seems like we're hitting parallels to this guy a lot. Tetsuo Yamada, Refractor, 135 of 499. Got 51 insert of Duke Snyder. Bowman Scouts of Victor Robles, Kevin Millwood, Bowman Buyback, Bronze Stamp, Alex Bregman, Rookie of the Year Favorites insert. Talent Pipelines of Reds, Nick Senzel, Taylor Mail, and Amir Garrett. And a silver paper of Kyle Lewis to $4.99. Uh, we're going to divide them evenly amongst the teams. If there's an odd amount, we will random them. But we did have a parallel in the first case, an orange one that we'll have to we'll have to random. We got 48 Bowman of Warren Spawn and Sean Newcomb 92 Bowman. What's up, Doug? How are you? You still have that, huh? Dansby Swanson Bowman Scouts 
And there's a nice one right there. Blake Rutherford, Refractor Auto. Refractor Auto, 366 of 499. A nice signature on that one, too. Good start to box number six. Rutherford Refractor Auto to 499. Still got one auto left in here. Case one is done already, Doug. The video's already been uploaded. We did the hobby already. Got about two and a half boxes of jumbo left. Rookie of the Year favorites of Jarrell Cotton. 70th anniversary, DJ Stewart Red Paper. Homer Bush, bronze stamp, buyback. like a refractor auto, or a base auto. Talent Pipelines, Victor Robles, Eric Fetty, and Austin Voth. And a base auto of Sandy Alcantara. The hobby was actually a little slow. We did have a couple nice cards, but the jumbo has been... Quite a bit better as far as the bigger names go. I really like this stuff. I don't know how much further beyond a hundred dollars a box it can go though. What's uh sixteen Bowman hobby boxes now? Phil Bickford, Bowman Scouts, Suspet is ninety two Bowman. I'd like to buy some more, but it's just getting too too pricey. Sixteen Bowman is Pretty good amount over a hundred a box, though. Ryan actually still has a couple cases of 16 Bowman. I'm surprised he hasn't sold them. We got Felix Hernandez purple paper, 130 of 250. And a blue shimmer of Joe Jimenez, non-numbered parallel. For hobby, you think it'll be that much for hobby? Braden Looper, silver stamp. Because it's pretty close to $200 a box jumbo already.
I think the problem is is uh, none of us really expected them to have the big late edition names like Rutherford. I personally thought they were going to hold Rutherford for Chrome. That was a big ad at the very end. I'd like to buy a case and leave it sealed, but I, I don't have those uh, abilities to not open product if I have it in front of me. Rookie of the Year favorites, David Dahl, Raphael Devers, 92 Bowman. That's almost next to impossible for me to restrain myself from opening Bowman. Last pack of box six. Bowman Scouts, Nick Gordon, 51 Bowman, Austin Meadows. Two more jumbo boxes left. Box number seven. Rookie of the Year favorites, Yohan Mankata. And nice gold paper of Cody Bellinger. That is number 11 of 50 gold paper. Cody Bellinger, gold paper, 11 of 50. Got Toby Hall, gold stamp buyback. Talent Pipelines, Phillies, Moniac, Dylan Cousins, J.P. Crawford. Got a 70th anniversary blue of P.J. Conlon. And a base auto behind it of Lucas Ersig. Base auto. Lucas Ersig base. Bowman Scouts, Corey Ray, 92 Bowman, Ken Griffey Jr.
Silver Paper, Robinson Cano to $4.99 and a blue refractor of Nick Senzel. Where's the ink on that one, Nick? Number 97 of 150, blue refractor. We got Richard Hildalgo, bronze stamp buyback card. All right, Scott, have a good one, man. I'll do my best. Have a good night at work. Hunter Renfro, Rookie of the Year favorites, and a 92 Bowman Bryce Harper. What's up, you ball? Bowman Scouts Kyle Lewis insert. 48 insert of Alex Bregman. Talent Pipeline insert of Austin Meadows, Kevin Newman, and Mitch Keller for the Pirates. 48 insert of Giancarlo Stanton and a refractor of Michael Kopik to $4.99. Rookie of your favorites, Dansby Swanson and a base auto. Francisco Rios, prospect for Toronto. There it is again. Need a parallel autograph in this box. That's a pretty tough spot. Tavares doesn't have a, a whole lot other than the inserts, and one of the inserts is really hard to get. The Bowman Scouts one, those are, there's a hundred different, you don't, you don't get very many per case. Kevin Maiton. I mean, if you hit one of them, a parallel or an autograph, you're, you're high flying, that's for sure. Josh Beckett, stamp buyback. Seemed like he had signed a little bit for the retail product. So those were selling good on eBay. I would imagine he'll be one of the bigger names in Bowman Chrome. I know you're not. It's just a tough spot. 
Xander Bogarts, 51 Bowman. Nolan Arnado, 92 Bowman. What level is he at? He's probably low A ball right now. He's just a young in, isn't he? You got Talent Pipeline Giants, Brian Reynolds, Christian Arroyo, and Clayton Blackburn. And Purple Paper of Juan Hillman, numbered 79 of 150. And last pack of box seven. Francisco Mejia, Bowman Scouts, and I think we got a Bowman Ascent Auto. Bowman Ascent Autograph of Trevor Story. That is number 28 of 99. I've had Mazzara sign for me. He's a pretty nice guy. I got him last year in Des Moines. Mazzara was a nice guy. Him and Gallo, both were that when they were there, were good signers in person. Second half hasn't really been that bad either. I mean, we had two nice uh, refractor autos with Rutherford and Torres. I just haven't hit much for color. I just had the one purple in the insert auto. So we need to finish with a nice low numbered auto for somebody. Last one, jumbo box number eight. Rookie of the Year favorites, Tyler Glass now, and a purple paper of Jemai Jones. Number 37 of 250. Got a silver stamp buyback of Michael Young. Really, Frank Thomas was tough, huh? I think Frank's supposed to be a pretty good in-person signer. I've got Michael Young in person in spring training before.
We got talent pipelines of Orioles prospects Chance Cisco, Chris Lee, and Cody Sedlock, followed by a purple auto. Jose Tavares, purple auto. One sixteen of two fifty. First auto of this box. Really the only guys that I had problems with were uh, Joey Votto and Felix Hernandez. Those were the two encounters that I was pretty disappointed with, how those went down. Amir Garrett, Bowman Scouts insert. Alex Bregman, 92 Bowman. Signs a bunch though, doesn't he? Durant. I mean, these it changes over time, but well, there's a nice uh, Chris Bryant silver paper to four ninety nine. Also got Kevin Newman, Refractor. 9 of 4.99. We also got Ruben Cavado. Bronze stamp buyback. I never had a chance at Griffey, but I did get an Ichiro when he was with Seattle in 2010, and I'm still pretty excited over that experience. That was a madhouse for me to get that one. was super lucky. Rookie of the Year favorites, Alex Reyes, 92 Bowman, Anthony Rizzo. He didn't say anything, Shem. There was just an absolute mob of people. Absolute mob of people. And I was just trying to reach as far as I could and get an arm's length. Brady Aiken, Bowman Scouts. 48 insert of Yohan Mankata. The one that kills me is missing out on as many Mike Trout autograph baseballs as I could eat. I didn't get him once while he was in single A Cedar Rapids for that half season. I have got him before, but I could have had as many as I wanted. That's the crusher. Talent pipelines, Josh Lowe, Willie Adams, Jacob Faria. Talent pipelines, 48 Rizzo, or excuse me, Rizzuto insert. And a purple refractor of Alex Kirilov. 246 of 250. Never had a shot at Jeter. I'd love to have a signed Jeter baseball, but never had that shot.
someone did tell me that uh, he's very good at remembering people. If you've gotten him before, there was a good chance he was going to call you out for trying again. We got Rookie of the Year favorites, Josh Bell, in front of a blue autograph. There we go. Jason Groom, blue. That is number 52 of 150, blue refractor auto. Nice name there. Fifty two of one fifty. Nice hit for the groom spot. Don't hear much from old Sammy Sosa in the game of baseball anymore. I wonder what old Sammy Sosa is up to these days. Bradley Zimmer, Bowman Scouts. Tim Redding, Silver Stamp Buyback. Dansby Swanson, 51 Bowman insert. Mark McGuire, 92 Bowman. Got an Andrew Benintendi Rookie of the Year Favorites insert. Talent Pipeline of the Rockies, Brennan Rogers, Ryan McMahon, and Kyle Freeland. Silver Paper of Mitch Keller to $4.99. And the last pack of the break. Looks like a base auto. Bowman Scouts, Hunter Renfro, and a base auto of Taylor Clark. Taylor Clark, base autograph, finishes this off. Well, hopefully I can relay some good news on your trout grade, Adam. That was a pretty awesome hit. Last few cards of the break before the recap. If you guys are heading out, appreciate it. We will do a recap and then the random at the very end. I'll have Ryan random the talent pipeline orange that we hit in the first case.
I don't believe so, Adam. You too, bud. We'll talk to you soon. sure what our plans for tomorrow are. I think we're going to do some Bowman for sure. I'm not sure the format, though. I'll discuss it with Ryan, and I'll send you a message on Facebook. Okay, I think I got everything ready to go. Let's recap it. Case two of the player break. This was the jumbo case. We got the hobby posted in a separate video. Here are the numbered paper parallels that we got in the jumbo case. Purples to 250. We had Jemai Jones, Juan Hillman, Felix Hernandez, Acel Soto. Blues to 150, we had Paul Goldschmidt, Glaber Torres, Adonis Medina. Golds to 50, we had Cody Bellinger, 11 of 50, and Jackie Bradley Jr., 13 of 50. And the uh, Bowman's 70th anniversary, we had Juan Hellman, Lourdes Guriel Jr., Brent Honeywell, and DJ Stewart. Refractor parallels. We had purples to 250 of Alex Kirilov, Tetsuo Yamada, Andy Abanez. We had one blue shimmer of Joe Jimenez. 70th anniversary blues. We had PJ Conlon, Juan Hillman, Tomoyuki Sugano. Blue Refractors, we had Nick Senzel, 97 of 150, and Willie Adams, number 75 of 150. We had one gold of Cole Stewart, number 13 of 50. One red of Brent Honeywell, number 1 of 5. And we had an insert, 92 Bowman Gold Refractor of Alex Bregman which was numbered 33 of 50. And autographs. Did you beat me? I think you won still. Base autos in the jumbo case. We had Wilmer Becerra, Abraham Gutierrez, Angel Perdomo, Elneri Garcia, Jason Groom, Kevin Maitan, Taylor Clark, Francisco Rios, Lucas Ursig, Sandy Alcantara, David Thompson, and base rookie autos, we had Joe Musgrove and David Dahl. Parallel autographs, we had Refractors the 499 of Jose Tavares, Ronald Acuna, Glaber Torres, and Blake Rutherford. Oh, that's a couple nice ones. Purple to 250, we had Luis Carpio, number 223 of 250, and Jose Tavares, number 116 of 250. We had a blue of Jason Groom, number 52 of 150, and a blue rookie auto of Andrew Benintendi. I like that card. Very nice looking card there. That was number 25 of 125. We had one gold of Justin Macy. 20 of 50, one Bowman Ascent of Trevor Story, number 28 of 99, and one 92 Bowman 
Autograph insert number 19 of 25, Greg Maddox. Do you want to do the random on this video? Uh, yeah. I can take that up to Tori. I'll take it up to her. She needs some motivation to get going. Okay. Now I can crack the whip if you want. <laughs> it's better for me. Threaten food. All right. Jake, the best way to get a hold of them is on Facebook. Are you on Facebook, Jake? I can't remember if you're on there or not. If not, I can, uh... Okay. Can you IM me? I'll give you best price without fees on Facebook. Talent pipeline. Thanks, David. Sorry, everybody doesn't hit. It's always like that. Some people win and... But we fun, have it fun doing it. Yeah, that's the best way. If you have trouble with that or something, just tag your name in one of the posts. Or tag my name and I'll find it for you. Okay, I'm going to do um, a couple different... Actually, I'm going to just do one random. There's no duels in this, right? Just triples? Okay, what I'm going to do is I'm going to give priority on the pipelines for left, middle, or right. Now, it'll be who wins this card, but it'll also be on the smaller ones. We have odd numbers of some. Sometimes, like, we'll have two of them, maybe one. I just got to have preference on who wins in what order. Where's the dice cup? Mm -hmm. I don't know. So as, but uh, we'll do it all in one random right now as soon as we find the cup. Okay. So the clicks are going to be five times, and I had to restart my computer, so I'll probably have to put random back up here. It might take a minute. My default random is no longer there, so let me rebuild it real quick. Random left. Center, right. Okay, hold on a second. Let me get rid of this. Remove, remove. One in the middle there is uh, a little closer view. The one in the upper right is the full page. In case you care about the ULR or something weird like that. It's the same screen on both though. Left, center, and right. So we're going to click five times again. Three and a two. And this is going to be priority for the triples. And also on this Yankees card, the left is Torres, the middle is Sheffield, and the right is Frazier. So, let's go ahead and do it. One, two, three, four, five. So, for the actual Yankees card, left side wins, and that's Glaber Torres. So, Glaber wins the big card. And then, for the regular ones, I'd give preference for the other names. We try to even it out as much as we can. But this is the priority chart after five. If we have two, we'd give one to like the left side and the right side on a normal insert. If we have three, then each gets one and so forth. So left, right, center. And I think that's our break. I don't think there's any other randoms. Um, nothing tomorrow. We'll probably do some more Bowman on Facebook on Wednesday. Other than that, I hope everybody had a good night.
and we'll talk to you soon.